all right so what is going on today youtube now we got a new video for you guys today and not a new video but we got a new deck for you guys that we are going to be playing it is a oldie but goodie and we're playing some chaos zombies and holy crap this hand is very awful um, we are playing some chaos zombies because i did not know this card was a tuner and um, it lends itself to the zombie deck now i can try and um banish some good cards with that but i feel like that's not a good thing to do so what we're going to do is we're going to activate this and we're going to send us a we can send us a necro phase i feel like necro phase is cool i think spirit master is a lot better though yeah we're going to send spirit master just to give our opponent a little bit you know a little bit of worry about getting rid of gozuki so hopefully you know we can definitely use that to our advantage so we're going up against kobo now i probably should have been playing like tcg only and i think i am going to be doing that because i don't want to face uh, the hardships of uh um <clears throat> of just going up against some cards i just have no chance to because this deck is not built for that okay there's a battle phase so i'm guessing he's going to evenly match me but that's not really too smart <laughs> one card no i'm not gonna chain just gonna that was not the smartest i mean i guess i i i don't i don't understand it as a waste of it evenly matches either his hand is dead or his hand is really good um, to the point that he just needed to okay well there's a rescue cat um uh, i knew i should have picked tcg i just knew i should have did it um it's completely my fault definitely should have did it because now i'm going up against that shadal card and yeah it's not going to look it's not looking too good well it, it it doesn't really matter because oh no it's sub terra behemoth what do you do send a flip to your deck and spread some one from your hand face down okay well that's that's decent um that's I, I don't feel like that was the smartest thing to do but i i, I you know i i guess so he could send a flip so he could uh, see uh, this is better in shadows than it is in uh what's the name like this is way better once we turn full face up add a flip yeah this card is just super good this is like a shadow card this should be a shadow card shadow hound what does that do um okay um, i i didn't it's gonna just change oh that's what that does what does this do return it to the hand that's actually pretty decent i can actually that's actually pretty decent i'm not even gonna hate on that that was actually pretty decent i really thought this was just oh see i thought this was just only for your opponent's cards um i still don't agree with the uh what's the name but I guess you can just add me. This was kind of like a wait, unless he had Shadow Fusion or something. Yeah, that was kind of a waste. You definitely. Ooh, there's a there's a terraforming. Yeah, we're definitely activating that. So we're gonna get that uh, solitaire. Now, what do we want to do here? We. Oh, I know exactly what we can do. We can do some good things. Uh, what we're gonna do is activate this, uh, and then what we're gonna do is use you to dump the uh, Necroface because yeah we're gonna get live uh, we're gonna attack over this we attack into it not gonna attack over it that's going to kill itself we're going to banish the necroface as cost we're going to special summon this unit zombie over here necroface triggers bam 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 we hit another necroface bam 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 uh yeah we could let me see hmm let me see what's in our graveyard do i want to activate do I want to put it back in my deck? Um, don't do want to put it back in my hand. Actually, I kind of don't. Is this one is normal or special? So yeah, that's cute. Yeah, we're definitely gonna mess with that. Um, no, I don't want to. No, we're not gonna do that here. Um, what we're going to do is gonna go main phase two, and then what we can do here is do this. We could special summon. Sure, new uh, samurai banished to pop this, and then we can go Omega. I feel like that's cool. One, two, three, four. Bam! I can use his, or him as his effect to go ahead and banish that to pop this individual, and then we could use uh, what's the name's effect to go ahead and send us a Zuki to the graveyard. And I feel like that's uh. 
that is a decent play since we're only at uh, what's the name we can roll with that hmm actually what we can do here is this we can use this Mizuki to special summon this because then the Omega what I'm going to get back with Omega when I go put back in the Omega I can just banish with Samurai so that's I feel like that's a good play this is why man this deck is just so fun um, so what are we gonna put back here uh, we can put back a Necroface we can put back Spirit Master um, what do you guys think? I think Spirit Master might be the best because he does have Hedgehog. So yeah, let's put back to Spirit Master because I don't want no crazy shit going on. So <clears throat> Omega's already going to put this at automatically eight. So that's going to be good for that. Um, and then, like I said, we have a free pop, and if he attacks it, it gets banished. Also, so um, technically we have nine counters. Like I said, we can bring back Omega. We can bring back the Giant Golem even if we feel like. We can bring back the, the, the four star tuna which triggers upon summon and it's not once per turn. Oh never mind, it is once per turn. Okay. And I was thinking that we should probably put a uh we should probably put like one level seven or higher metaphys, but then I was like, and eh, it's kinda gimmicky. It's kind of gimmicky. But you know what? It it, it it seems cool. It seems real cool. So if he tries to be cute and attack this with Shadal Dragon. Um, I can definitely just use the effect to banish the Yuna zombie, and yeah, I, I just feel like we're we're just doing real good right now. So we can't activate even the match from his hand. Um, so I, I think we're just in a good position, man. That top deck terraforming was really good. The fact that we hit Necroface was even better. Um, yeah, so I feel like we got there. Um, we was going to be we was going to be places regardless, but I feel like we got there because. Um, oh yeah, we're definitely activating this Omega. Don't even, don't even try to play me, young man. That's just happening right there off tops. Um, and then, like, if he attacks this, no, we're not going to do anything when it's attacking. But uh, no, not before. What? Why didn't they give me the during damage calculation? Okay, well, I see how the game want to play me. That's fine. And we also have another addition to the deck. Yeah, we, we're going to win because if he does, he, he must have either struggling battle where he just doesn't know what Samurai does. Okay, well, that's that's even better. Okay, so what we can do is that, um, hmm, I can put this Necroface back to the deck. Back to the graveyard, I mean. Should I do that? I feel like I should. Um, actually, I'm going to put Mizuki back. Yeah, I'm going to put Mizuki back. Right? Then what I'm going to do is I'm going to activate another Chaos Zone. No need to chain. Then we can normal summon this. And since this is a four-star tuner, we get a free three banish. Ooh, we even hit a what's the name, but nothing was banished. Um, we can go Omega and we can hit something. We can go Omega and we can hit something. Um, and we could possibly put this... We can put it at four though. So let's see. We're gonna go into our first Omega with these two. Bam, right? Then we could go Mizuki to a Gozuki. And we still have uh yeah, we still have two left. So then we can use Gozuki's effect to dump a Mizuki. And then we could use Mizuki. To special summon this guy, All right? And then we could use his effect to banish Unizombie, putting that at four, and then we could use all four off the counter to special summon. I already used Gozuki. We can special summon Solitaire, tribute, and get a Sage. Do y'all feel like we should? And Hedgehog has how much defense? That has 200. So we could. That's um. That's actually exactly. Um. It's actually exactly game. It's actually exactly game. That's exactly what it is. And we still haven't used what's the name's effect. So let's see if we can actually get game here. There's a hedge. Oh my god, that hurts so much. <laughs> oh god, that was a fucking squabata. That was horrible. That was horrible. He's probably going to hit one of these Omegas. Yeah, that's that's clear. Um, but that's, once again, that's fine. We can just attack him with this. He has an evenly match. We're just in a lot of trouble. 
Um, what are the odds, though? I really don't want to attack his car because I'm scared of evenly match. You know what? I'm not going to. I'm not going to because that's how scared I am of evenly match. But what we're going to do here is we're going to put back a chaos zone because that's just really important for us. So we're going to activate this. Okay, there's that. Um, so that wasn't really a problem. We can go ahead and get this unit zombie. Then what we can do here, Jesus Christ, I did not expect, I thought that was going to be a hedgehog. We're going to just dump the two because, uh, you know, we just have another Omega. We played three in this deck, so, yeah, that's, um, that's definitely something that's possible. And, yeah, I feel like we're just going to win this game. Uh, yeah, like I said, man, even if he does have Shadal Fusion, that doesn't really do anything. What we're going to do is we're going to return this to Echo Face because I want to banish some more cards. Um... Most likely that should have possibly been Mizuki, but like I said, we can get Mizuki at any point in time because of Chaos Zone. Um, and like I said, Shadal Fusion doesn't do nothing. Only thing that really scares me is Struggling Battle. Um, and that's really the only card I'm scared of because he already activated it once. So, I mean, if I don't have game, I can't go for it. And I guess that's, that's a good part of Evenly Matched. Um, yeah, yeah, we're just going to do this. Oh, there they Hit too. So that's good. Um, and like I said, he's just, I'm just going to activate, uh, I'm just going to keep the Chaos Zone because Chaos Zone is a lot more important than the Samurai. Let's just activate this right now. Let's banish that. Banish seven more. Um, and what is that, a Smith? Sure, let's activate. I don't even know what's, oh, there's my Giant Rex. So we can get the Giant Rex out right there. And then, yeah, Smith is... Oh, it's at 11. Jesus Christ. How much did I hit? There's two Shadal Fusions. That means there's one left. He's run Gem Knights. He's running, <laughs> he's running a whole bunch of shit. Okay, so, I mean, he didn't have anything. Uh, but, yeah, there's my special attack, the Gem Knight Rex. Yeah, yeah, this game's over. All right, so now, oh, there's another Chaos Zone, so that's even better. Um, yeah, This is, uh, this is not looking good for our opponent. So let's go ahead and do this. Banish the what's the name? Bam. Special summon the two star right on back. Uh, there's nothing to pop its face down, which sucks. I mean, Sun Saga, but that's neither here nor there. So we're not going to do that today. We're going to special summon our Crystal Wing. This can't attack directly, so this can attack the face down. Um, and yeah, man, we could just special summon, <laughs> we could special summon, uh, uh, like, oh, we can get the snow back. I, I, I don't even know why I'm saying that. We definitely get the snow back. We definitely don't want no, uh, mishaps. Definitely not booking. And then, yeah, there we go. We, we have game here. So we're going to attack with Crystal Wing because whatever this is, whatever it activates, no, we're not going to do that. Whatever, it, if, it, if it does activate, we could just negate with Crystal Wing. And since this can't attack directly, we can just go ahead and. Yeah, we're not negating that. That has nothing to do with anything. Like I said, we could just attack with the rest of this. Does he, oh, he doesn't even have a target left. So he already has a Shadal Fusion in hand. You just couldn't use it because of the Omegas. Um, and yeah, so <clears throat> yeah, we, 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 we came back with Chaos Zombies. And we're doing pretty decent. We're doing real good. And I'm scared to put on Ignore Chain because I don't want him to randomly activate something. Um, all right, so there we go. Got a free, I mean, not a free victory, but a uh, chaos zone, man. Just this really good. All right, so be back with the deck list, so stay tuned. All right, folks, so we are back with the deck list, and I know it's it's a rough draft, so don't don't take anything right as you can see it right now. Don't take any of it to the heart. It's just a rough draft. I went over that pretty fast, so here we go. We're going to just slide over a whole bunch of cards. But, yeah, like I said, man, that Metaphys, when I found out that Metaphys card was a tuner, I said, yeah, we definitely got to go back to this deck. This is just, this is just, um, this is just, it's too good for it to not be in the deck. But, yeah, that's it for the first duel of the day. So, stay tuned. Hope you guys did enjoy that. And if you do would like to support the channel, all I ask for you guys to do is click an ad. That would be enough for me. Thank you very much. Stay tuned. In the next couple of hours, we got another one.